morning. Good morning, family. Today, we are going forth into morning dew, victorious, understanding that our Father is more than able to deal with everything concerning us. He's more than able to break the evil altar of stagnation in our life. So we go forth this morning, trusting and believing him to work each and everything out in our life because he's more than able. So uh, we always want to begin by entering into his gates with thanksgiving and into his courts with praise. It says, be thankful to him and bless his name for the Lord is good. His mercy is everlasting and his truth endures to all generations. So may we lift up our voice and enter into his gates with thanksgiving and into his courts with praise. We have to be thankful to him and bless his name because he is good, he is merciful, his mercy is everlasting, and his truth endures to all generations. And may we enter giving our Father praise this morning. Almighty, loving, and most wonderful Father. Thank you, Father. We're so grateful to you. Um, we come Thank to you this day, Father, with hearts of gratitude to you, Father. Thank you, Father. Thank you, Father. Thank you this morning. Father, we thank you. Thank you, O Lord. Thank you, Father. We thank you. Thank you that you go before us, O Lord, that you take care of everything. Thank you for your hand of protection over us, O Lord. Thank you for our families and our even our workplaces that are safe. Oh God. Yeah, for them, Lord. I'm thankful to them. you for who you are to me. That you take care of us and to our families, Lord. That you go before us, oh Lord. That you take care of us, oh Lord. Every yoke, oh Lord, that is trying to pull us down, God. Thank you. Oh, thank you for the great things off of us, oh Lord. Yes, Lord. We pray today, oh Lord. Serious mindset, God. We go into this today. Take care of everything concerning us, oh we enter into your place with thanksgiving, O oh Lord. We thank you, O oh Lord. We bless your holy name, Father, because you are good. Father, thank you. Thank you for all. Bless your holy name, O oh, Father. Thank you on the line this morning, O oh God. Thank you for all who are listening this message, O oh God. I thank you, Father God, that we have ears to hear, O oh Lord, mouths to speak, O oh Lord, eyes to see, O oh God. Father, I thank you. Yeah, Lord, that we woke up in the right mind, O oh God. With full use of our body, O oh Father God. Thank you. Yes, Lord, none was lost throughout the night. Father, I thank you. We are so thankful to you, Father, for the battles won. Yes, in our lungs, Father, the victory of the cross. So thank you for the security we have in your word. God, we are victors. So grateful to you. Every word that builds us up daily. Oh God, Father, we say thank you. Father, we thank you because we are not. Oh Father, I give you all praise. Thank you, Daddy God. Thank you, Daddy God. The spirit of courage is a standard that will yes, give you praise. Just thank, thank you, God. Thank you. Thank you. Lord, give us the victory. Christ. Father, we thank you. I'm grateful to you, Lord. We thank you for the sacrifice. We thank you, O Lord, that you sent your son forth into the world, O Lord. Yes, just us, Father. Just us. Thank you, O God. All praise, glory, and honor. Bless for the inheritance we have for the cross that we have been purchased and redeemed. Yes, Lord. And thank you for the confidence we have in you, that we are yours. Thank you, Daddy. Thank you, God. Thank you, I'm so grateful to you. 
Yes, Lord. Bless me. We give you praise. We give you glory. We give you honor. Thank you, Lord. Yes. For covering us with your righteous right hand. Yes. Thank you for the strategies you give us over all our battles. Yes. Thank you, Father, for the victory in you. Yes. Thank you because your word says that the one who is born of you yes. is the one who overcomes. Yes. And it is a victory. Yes. Uh, it's a victory of those who overcome our faith, yes. oh God. Yes. Uh, Father, I pray that we will grow strong in faith yes. so that we will continue to overcome. In yes. Jesus' name. Yes, Lord. We bless your holy name, Father. Thank you, Lord. Ah, we bless you. Thank you, Daddy. Thank you. Thank you, Father. Our uh, prayer will be unto you, Father God. Thank you. Thank you, Father. Thank you, Lord. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Father, we thank you. We thank you, O oh Lord, because you are good, you are kind. We thank you, Lord, for the gift that you have given us, O oh Lord, the gift that keeps on giving, Father. Yes, Lord, the water that doesn't run dry. Father, we thank you. Mm -hmm. Lord, we so grateful to you, Lord. We bless your holy name, Father. Thank you. Thank you, Lord. We bless that God. Thank you. Thank you, Father. Thank you for the son that you sent into the world to be the sacrifice, the sacrifice just for us, Father. We are so grateful to you, Lord. We thank you. It hurt you, but you did that just for us, Father. The pains, all of that just for us because you loved us so far. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Thank you. Yes, Lord. You sent your son into the world. Yes, Lord. Oh, brother. A oh, miserable death just for us. Yes, shed in so many places. Just, just for us. He took everything off us. And we ought to be so grateful. We ought to be so grateful. Father, we thank you. We thank you, God. Thank you for the sacrifice that you gave just for us. You're so selfless, Lord, just for us, Father. Yes, Lord, and we are so grateful to you, Lord. Mm -hmm. You were not selfish when it came to us, Father. I thank you. We bless your name, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Thank, Thank you for the sacrificial lamb of Jesus Christ that you yes. sent just to us. We remember, Lord, and we are so grateful. Thank you. Yes, Lord, we bless your name. Thank you, Lord. Yes, Lord, we have to say thank you. Thank you. So grateful for the victory, so God. Thank you, Lord. Thank you. Thank you, Lord. Thank you. He did not leave us, oh Lord. Every step, Father, and we say thank you. Thank you. Thank you, Lord. Bless your name. Thank you. Yes, Father. With the bread in our hand, we remember. We remember. We remember the body that was broken, that was beaten, that was bruised just for us. Oh, Father, we thank you. Thank you, thank you Father. It says, for I received from the Lord that which I also delivered to you. 
that the Lord Jesus, on the same night in which he was betrayed, he took bread, and when he had given thanks, he broke it and said, Take, eat, this is my body, which is broken for you. Do this in remembrance of me. Oh, Father, we thank you. Jesus knew he was going to be betrayed by the ones within his circle, but he still, he broke bread and he said, take, eat, this is my body, which is broken for you. And he did what you called him for to do. Father, we say thank you. Thank you, Father. Bless your name, Father. Thank you, oh God. Jesus. Yes, Lord, we thank you. We are so grateful to you, Lord. Thank you. For all that the body Lord. Thank you, Lord. We all should be so grateful to you. Thank you, Father. Thank you for this gift that you have chosen to give us. Thank you. Thank you. Yes, Lord. Maybe break and partake. Thank you, Lord. Jesus. Thank you, Daddy. In the same manner, he also took the cup after supper, saying, This cup is a new covenant in my blood. This do as often as you drink it in remembrance of me. The blood that was shed in so many places just for us. Ah, oh, Father, we thank you. Yes, Lord, we are so grateful to you, Lord, for the sacrifice of your son, Jesus Christ. His blood was shed just for us. Remember, Lord, and we are so grateful to you, Father. Thank you. Thank you. Here we go. It says, for as often as you eat this bread and drink this cup, you proclaim the Lord's death till he comes. We are so grateful to you, Lord. Father, we thank you. Today, family, we are continuing in uprooting these evil altars that are trying to hold us down. Today, we are uprooting the altar of stagnation. Thank you. We are uprooting the altar of stagnation. It says... These are the words which Moses spoke to all Israel while they were still beyond, that is on the east side of the Jordan River, in the wilderness across from Jerusalem. In the Arabah, the long, deep valley running north and south from the eastern arm of the Red Sea to beyond the Dead Sea, opposite Sup, between Paran and Tophel, and Laban and Hezroth and Dezahab place of gold. It is only 11 days journey from Horeb, Mount Sinai, by way of Mount Ser, to Kadesh Baner, on Canaan's border. Yet, Israel wandered in the wilderness for 40 years before crossing the border and entering Canaan, the promised land. In the 40th year, on the first day of the 11th month, Moses spoke to the children of Israel in accordance with all that the Lord had commanded him to say to them. After he had defeated Sion, the king of the Amorites, who lived in Heshbon, and Og, the king of Bashan, who lived at Ashtaroth in Edre, beyond, east of the Jordan, in the land of Moab, Moses began to explain this law, saying, the Lord our God spoke to us at Horeb saying, you have stayed long enough on this mountain. You have stayed long enough on this mountain. You have stayed long enough on this mountain. Turn and resume your journey and go to the hill country of the Amorites and to all their neighbors in the Arabah, in the hill country and in the lowland the Shephala in the Negev South Country, and on the coast of the Mediterranean Sea, the land of the Canaanites and Lebanon, as far as the great river, the river Euphrates. Look, I have set the land before you. 
go in and take possession of the land which the law swore solemnly promised to your fathers, to Abraham, to Isaac, and to Jacob, to give to them and to their descendants after them. Our Father has showed us that it is time to stop wasting time going around the same mountain. Yes. That mountain can be anything that we have been going around continuously without forward movement. You know mm -hmm. what that mountain is to you. Each of us know what that mountain is to us. And it is time to stop wasting time going around the same mountain. It's time for us to move forward. Amen. Amen. Our father is a progressive person. He is a God of movement. In the Bible, God is moving and not stuck in one place. He wants us to grow from glory to glory. Amen. It says, and we all with unveiled face, continually seeing as in a mirror, the glory of the Lord are progressively being transformed into his image from one degree of glory to even more glory, which comes from the Lord who is the spirit. So family, we're going to begin today and we're going to pray through every slide after this and we're going to uproot the evil altar of stagnation in our lives. May we all unmute and begin. Heavenly Father, Heavenly Father, holy is your name and greatly to be praised. I worship and adore you in Jesus' name. May your kingdom manifest in my life as it is in heaven. Plead my cause, O oh Lord, with those who strive with me. Fight against any entity or person who is contending against me. When you say this, family, say it and really truly mean it. And ask the Father, yes, ask the Father, to plead our cause with those who strive with us and fight against any entity or person who is contending against you. And yes. Yes. Worship you, Lord. We worship and adore you, Father. Yes, holy is your name and greatly to be praised. Thank you, Lord. Yes, yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. Our sacrifices with shouts of joy. And now my head will be lifted up above my enemies around me. In his tent, I will offer sacrifices with shouts of joy. Sing. Yes, I will sing praises to the Lord. Yes. I enjoin my worship to the heavenly chorus. Worship of your holy angels and the crowd of witnesses in Jesus' name. Yes, we sing praise to the Father. Yes, family. Yes, we sing praise to the Lord. Yes, we enjoin our worship to the heavenly chorus of worship of your holy angels and the crowd of witnesses in Jesus' name. Yes, yes. We're going to ask for the Lord of Heaven to be seated. So, Father, righteous judge, I ask for the Lord of Heaven to be seated according to Daniel 7 9 to 10. I ask this in Jesus' mighty name. Because it is written, I kept looking until thrones were set up and the ancient of days, God, took his seat. His garment was white as snow and the hair of his head like pure wool. His throne was flames of fire. His wheels were a burning fire. A river of fire was flowing and coming out from before him. A thousand thousand were attending him, and ten thousand times ten thousand were standing before him. The court was seated, and his books were open. 
thank you father because i've been seated to yes. listen to the judgment that has been pronounced against the universe my life in the name yes. of the father i request the privilege of standing before the courtroom of the ancient of days what was revealed to the prophet daniel in jesus name i pray Heavenly Father, I stand in your royal courtroom because of the blood and finished work of Jesus on the cross. I have come to receive your righteous judgment over my life against the spirit of the stagnation that Satan planted in my generational bloodline. Yes. yes. Yes, Father, we request the privilege of standing before the court. Yes, Father. thank you, Lord, because of the blood and finished work of Jesus on the cross. Yes, we have come to receive our righteous judgment, oh, God, against the spirit and altar of stagnation. Yes, Father. Lord. Heavenly Father. I call upon your holy angels to be witnesses to my lawsuit and righteous prosecution of the evil altar of stagnation. I decree and declare that this evil altar of stagnation will no longer arrest my progress or that of my family members. Neither will it hinder my ability to excel in life and business. In Jesus' name, I pray. May we pray this family. Yes. Yes. Father, we thank you. We call on your holy angels to be witnesses to our lost and righteous prosecution of the evil altar of stagnation. Yes, we decree and declare this evil altar of stagnation will no longer arrest our progress or that of our family members. It will not hinder our ability to excel in life. And in Jesus. business, in Jesus' name we pray. Thank you, Father. Thank you, Lord. Yes, Daddy God, we thank you. Oh, blessed be your name, Father. Yes, Lord. Heavenly Father, in the word of First John 2, 1 to 2 says, My little children, these things I write to you so that you may not sin. And if anyone sins, we have an advocate with the Father. Jesus Christ, the righteous, and he himself is appropriation for our sins, and not for ours only, but also for the whole world. Thank you. I thank you that Jesus is my faithful advocate before the righteous judge in the court of heaven. Thank you. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, my God, and my King. Thank you. See no more. Yes, Lord, I thank you. Yes, Lord. Lord Jesus, I surrender my rights to self representation and summon you as my advocate to help me plead my case before the righteous judge and prosecute the evil altar of stagnation that Satan planted in my bloodline to cause arrested development. I also ask the blessed Holy Spirit, who is the highest officer of the courts of heaven here on earth, to make me sensitive to the proceedings of this court in order to successfully prosecute the evil altar of stagnation in Jesus' name. Yes, Father, we thank you. Yes, Lord. Heavenly Father, even as I stand in your royal courtroom, I present myself as a living sacrifice, holy and acceptable before you according to Romans 12, 1. Heavenly Father, righteous judge, I summon the altar of stagnation in my bloodline and the idol that sits on it to appear in your royal court to face prosecution in Jesus' name. Yes, family, imagine that you're calling them. See it, that you're calling them to face prosecution. Yes, Lord. Thank you, Father. 
For it is written in 1 Corinthians 6, 3. Do you not know that we believers will judge angels? How much more than as to matters of this life? Heavenly Father, I exercise my God-given authority in Christ Jesus to judge demons and principalities in Jesus' name, I pray. Righteous judge, it is also written in the constitution of your kingdom in 1 John 3, 8. For this purpose, the Son of God was manifested that he might destroy the works of the devil. Yes, Lord, we thank you. Heavenly Father, I know that until the end of the age of sin, Satan will have Satan still has legal access to the courts of heaven to make accusations against the children of men. For it is written in the book of Revelation 12 10. Then I heard a loud voice in heaven saying, Now the salvation and the power. And the kingdom, dominion, reign of our God, and the authority of his Christ have come. For the accuser of our believing brothers and sisters has been thrown down at last. He who accuses them and keeps bringing charges of sinful behavior against them before our God day and night. Heavenly Father, the Lord Jesus also said in the book of Matthew 5, 25, come to terms quickly at the earliest opportunity with your opponent at law while you are with him on the way to court so that your opponent does not hand you over to the judge and the judge to the guard and you are thrown into prison. Heavenly Father, in all humility, while renouncing the spirit of pride, I choose to quickly agree with the legal accusations of my adversary, Satan. Righteous judge, every accusation that Satan has filed against me and my bloodline in this court is true. Yes, yes Father. I choose to quickly agree with our adversary, Father. Yes, yes God. Yes. And now we repent for them. Mm -hmm. Heavenly Father, I repent for my personal transgressions, mm -hmm. for the sins mm -hmm. and iniquities of my forefathers that mm -hmm. opened the door for the mm -hmm. spirit mm -hmm. and altar of stagnation to oppress my life in Jesus' name, I pray. Mm -hmm. Lord, every mm -hmm. sin of my forefathers that the enemy is using as a legal That's right to build cases against me and to deny me my destiny, I ask that the blood of Jesus would just wash them away. I also repent for self-inflicted word curses and all covenants with demons that have existed in my ancestral bloodline. Father, yes, Lord, we repent, Lord. Yes, Father, we repent, Father God. Yes, we repent for our personal transgressions, oh Father God, and for the sins and iniquities of our forefathers, oh God, that opened the door for the spirit and altar of stagnation to oppress our life, Father. Yes, Lord, we thank you. Thank you. Yes, Lord, we ask that the blood of Jesus will just wash them away. Yes, Father. Thank you. I am asking that every covenant with demonic powers will now be revoked and that their right to claim me and my bloodline would now be dismissed before your court in Jesus' name. We thank you, Lord, for revoking these demonic covenants and evil altars in Jesus' mighty name. Heavenly Father, in my heartfelt desire to divorce myself from the spirit and altar of stagnation, I give back everything and anything that the devil would say came from his kingdom 
And I only want what the blood of Jesus has cured for me. Yes. Give back everything and anything that the devil would say came from his yes. Thank you, Lord. Hallelujah. The blood of Jesus has Blessed be your holy name, O God. Thank you, Jesus. Glory to your name, Lord. You are worthy, you are worthy, you are worthy, O God. Thank you, Lord, for sealing up the doors in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Oh God, we oh give you praise, oh God. Thank you, Lord. Jesus, God, cover those doors, oh God. And the angels of the Lord will escort every demonic forces out in Jesus' name. Father, we give you praise and we bless you, oh God, this morning. Move it on my behalf in the name of Jesus Christ. We present badly with ours, but it's your Lord. So we give it to you this morning. Thank you. And we surrender Thank you. all to you in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Yes. You are you are the judge in the courtroom. Yes. And God, we thank you for yes. you move in our case in the name of Jesus Christ. We thank you that the victory is ours in the name of Jesus. Yes, we bless you and glorify you in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Yes, Father. Glory to God. Thank you. Jesus' name. Jesus. Thank you for cleansing me by your blood. So Satan has no legal footing against me in your courtroom. It is written in 1 John 1, 9. If we freely admit that we have sinned and confess our sins, he is faithful and just, true to his own nature and promises, and will forgive our sins and cleanse us continually from all all unrighteousness, all our own wrongdoing, everything not in conformity with his will and purpose. Yeah. Thank you. Yes. Thank you. Thank you. Yes, Lord. Thank you. Yes. Thank you for the name of Jesus. We thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. We Thank praise you, according to your word in First John yeah. 1 9. Father, we gather together in the unity yeah. of the faith so that we may lift up the name of Jesus and confess one to another in Jesus' name and leave everything that easily besets us at your feet in the name of Jesus Christ. Father, we ask you to consume it with your consuming fire in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. God, we bless you and praise you this morning in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Father God, we thank you, Lord, for those things that we have not confessed, oh God. Yes. We pray that you reveal it to us in the name of Jesus yes. Christ, yes. that we may lay it down in the name of Jesus yes. Christ. Yes. And God, we give you praise. Yes. Have your way this morning in the name of Jesus Christ. Yes. Oh God, we give you praise, glory, and honor. We bless you, Lord. Yes. And we thank you in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Yes. Amen. Righteous judge, I appeal to the blood of Jesus to wash all my shortcomings, my transgressions and iniquities in Jesus' name. I pray. I receive by faith the cleansing power of the blood of Jesus. Yes, I receive by faith the cleansing power. Of the blood of Jesus, yes, Lord, Heavenly Father, Jesus finished work and my heartfelt repentance. I now move on the court of heaven to dismiss all of Satan's accusations and charges against me and my bloodline in Jesus' name. So it is written that the accuser of the brethren has been cast down. So I ask you, Father, to cast down all Satan's accusations against me. In Jesus' name, I pray. Father, I thank you for casting thank you, Lord. all of his accusations. Thank you, Father God. Father. We give you praise, yes. oh God, for the finished work of your name, Father. In our heartfelt repentance, Lord, we bless yes, you. Lord. We move to the court in the name of Jesus Christ and dismiss yes. every accusation by the accuser in the name of Jesus Christ. Thank you, Lord, that all charges in the name of Jesus Christ against me and my bloodline, even into four gener even into ten generation in the future, in the name of Jesus Christ. Is this mess, Father? We thank you that the accuser of the brethren is cast out 
Yes. So we ask you, Father, to cast down all Satan accusation against us. All in the name of accusations, oh God, in Jesus. God, name. we thank you and we pray, oh God, that you have placed yes. a mark upon us, oh God, and Heavenly as the blood Father, of Jesus Christ. Righteous judge, thank you, Lord. Oh, I ask that you send high ranking angelic Christ officers of the yes. that nothing that the enemy has accused us of was that yes. in Jesus' name. God, we give you praise, glory, and honor that we can come hold in your throne. In the name of Jesus Christ, in your throne of yeah. the court, in the name of Jesus, and they have your divine way. In the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth, whatever weapon that the enemy is formed against us, all accusation, oh God, in the name of Jesus Christ, has been null and void. In the name of Jesus, by the burden of your decision, in the name of Jesus Christ. That the blood of Jesus Christ cleanses us from all unrighteousness in the name of Jesus. All accusation has been erased in the name of Jesus Christ. Your word tells us, O oh God, in Colossians 3, that the handwriting that was against us has been wiped out. And oh God, we give you praise for your decision in the court, O oh God, for your decision to go forth. Without any any verdict that he's victorious in the name of Jesus Christ, because the blood of Jesus Christ sends us from all the righteousness. So we give you praise, glory, and honor, Lord God. We have your divine way in the name of Jesus Christ. Thank you, Lord, for representing us. Thank you, Father, for giving us the victory through Jesus Christ. Thank you, Lord Jesus, for your obedience to the Father and the obedience to the Father and the example that you have set in the name of Jesus Christ that we can count on you, Lord Jesus, because of what you have done. We thank you for the Holy Spirit. Glory to the God, the one that leads and guides us and teaches us and bring us into all truth. Holy Spirit, we thank you that you represent even in the courtroom, you're leading and guiding in the name of Jesus Christ and let truth prevail in Jesus' name. Father, we give you praise. Blessed be your holy name this morning, oh God. Thank you for what you have done. Thank you for the victory that you have given unto us. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth, Father, we bless you that you have made a way that we can come boldly to you yes, through Jesus Christ. And so, God, we give you praise. We yes. give you glory and honor. We say, have your divine way in Jesus. Yes, Lord. Heavenly Father, righteous judge, yes. that you send high-ranking angelic officers of the courts who excel in strength to execute the judgment of your Supreme Court and destroy the evil altar of stagnation and the idol that sits on it that satan planted in my bloodline in jesus name i pray by the spirit of prophecy i prophesy the complete destruction of the evil yes. of stagnation in my life yes yeah. it is written in psalms 91 11 12 for he will command his angels to guard you to protect and defend and guard you in all your ways of obedience and service they will lift you up in their hands so you don't even strike your foot against us receive angelic assistance right now in jesus name we receive assistance bless your name oh god yes lord Thank you, Father, for the angels that you've dispatched on our behalf. Lord, your word says that you have assigned angels to keep us We ask you this morning, O oh God, for high ranking angels to breathe more in the heavenlies in the name of Jesus. We thank you, Lord, that every evil altar that has been resurrected against us in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. We take authority over it. Now, in the name of Jesus yes. Christ, every evil altar that's resurrected against your people in the body of Christ, in the corners of the earth, we come against it now, in the name of Jesus Christ, by the blood of Jesus. We thank you, Lord, for each person in global discipleship platform and birth and freedom in the name of Jesus Christ. Nazareth. We thank you, Father God, that you're making your way. Glory to God and giving each person a victory in the name of Jesus Christ. Because your word says you'll do more than we can ask or think according to the power 
that work in us. So even if they didn't ask, oh God, we pray in the name of Jesus Christ that you are the judge in the courtroom on their behalf in the name of Jesus Christ. So we stand in proxy for each and every person, oh God, that represent the ministry in the name of Jesus Christ. I thank you right now, oh God, that I lift up Angel Chris in the name of Jesus Christ. I bring their case in the courtroom. In the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth, I pray for a victorious a verdict in Jesus' name. So, Father, move by your spirit in their, in their defense in the name of Jesus Christ. I thank you, Lord, that the enemy comes to kill, steal, and destroy. And this is a desire to destroy them in the name of Jesus Christ. But in this courtroom this day, I plead, oh God, to the judge that you will see about them in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Give them the verdict necessary, oh God. Let victory be their portion in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. And Father, I give you praise. Bless your holy name, oh God. Thank you for what you're doing, oh God. And thank you for how you're doing it. Thank you that you allow us to come to the courtroom. Oh God, that we can come to you to, to judge each case in the name of Jesus Christ. So we give you praise, give you glory, Lord. Thank you, Father, for each and every person that belongs to these ministries that you have given or care to in the name of Jesus Christ. Let the angels of the Lord go forth, oh God, and begin to bring to pass the words that have been spoken, the verdict that has been released in the name of Jesus Christ. And so, God, we give you praise. We give you glory and honor as you execute it now in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Amen. Amen. Heavenly Father, I present before your Supreme Court the following scriptures as my rock solid evidence against the spirit and altar of stagnation in my life. It is written, the righteous will flourish like the dead palm, long-lived, upright, and useful. They will grow like a cedar in Lebanon, majestic and stable. And he will be like a tree, firmly planted and fed by streams of water, which yields its fruit in its season. Its leaf does not wither, and in whatever he does, prospers and comes to majority. Righteous judge, based on the aforementioned scriptures, it is clear that the spirit and altar of stagnation, if allowed to succeed, would cause great injury to my life, destiny, and also inflict irreparable damage to the purposes of God. I ask that every legal right, the spirit and altar of stagnation is holding, be revoked in Jesus' glorious name. Righteous judge, based upon the aforementioned scriptures, it is clear that I qualify for a divine training order against the altar of stagnation and the idol that sits on it in Jesus' name. Thank you, Lord. Yes. All the name of the God to eradicate the spirit of stagnation in the name of Jesus Christ. Yes. You have sat down a verdict of not guilty in Jesus' name. We thank you, Lord, for the blood that the Spirit has been uprooted in the name of Jesus Christ, and the blood of Jesus was poured at the root of it in the name of Jesus. God, we give you praise and glory as we rejoice in the name of Jesus Christ. Thank you. Over the spirit of stagnation, I received it in the name of Jesus Christ. And so, God, we give you praise. We bless your God that that same victory has been extended to every person on yeah. Global Discipleship Platform, as well as Burning yeah. Freedom, yeah. in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. So, yeah. Father God, we give you praise. We thank you and praise you for the body of Christ in the four months of the earth. Let that same victory and that same verdict go forth on their behalf in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. God, we give you praise and glory and honor. We thank you for every ministry that's connected to us, oh God. We lift up the leaders and those that you have assigned to them in the name of Jesus Christ, to receive that verdict as well. In the name of Jesus, God, we give you praise. And we bless you in the name of Jesus Christ. This spirit is no longer tormenting. This spirit is no longer uh, plaguing your body in the name of Jesus Christ. But oh God, we, you have given the verdict and the angels of the Lord go forth to escort it out and carry out. Yes. Oh God, God, which has been released in Jesus' name. So we give you praise. Yes. We glorify you in it, in it, oh God, and we rejoice, yes. Father God, for the victory in Jesus' name. Amen. Thank you, Lord. Father, righteous judge, 
I need to ask for the divine restraining order and a permanent injunction against the spirit and arms of stagnation in my life would now be issued by the authority of your supreme court in Jesus' name. Heavenly Father, I decree and declare any and all spiritual or financial stagnation the devil has issued or is orchestrated against my life and now cancelled in Jesus' glory. For that yes, purpose, Lord, Lord. Thank you. that's close to the enemy in the name of yes, Jesus. Lord. There is no longer stagnation in the name of Jesus. Yes. Oh, it has so been arrested in the name of Jesus. Yes. So we yes. praise yes. Lord that we can rejoice that that demonic spirit, that demonic entity has yes. been, been yes. defeated in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Yes. And so, Father, we bless you for the permanent of this spirit being released from our lives in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Thank you, Father. Blessed be your holy name, O oh God. We glorify you, Father, and we give you all the praise and the honor for moving on behalf, O oh God, and for dealing with our case. So we thank you for the permanency in the name of Jesus Christ. Father, we give you glory in Jesus' name. Amen. Heavenly Father, I receive this divine restraining order and permanent injunction by faith in Jesus' name, for it is written in the constitution of your kingdom in Hebrews 11, 6. But without faith, it is impossible to walk with God and please him. For whoever comes near to God must necessarily believe that God exists Amen. and rewards those who earnestly and diligently seek him. We yeah. declare by faith that the spirit and altar of stagnation in my life has yes. been cleared in Jesus' name. Yes, Father. Thank you, Lord. Heavenly Father, righteous judge, you, Father. I ask you to seal the spirit and altar of stagnation in the process of May you also cover with the blood of Jesus all my legal proceedings in this case. I declare a righteous verdict of release and evil of stagnation is now secured the documents of the court. But it is written in John's Gospel, 836, so the Son makes it free, then you are unquestionably free. I decree and declare that I am free of the evil altar of stagnation. In Jesus' name. Glory to God. Hallelujah. Yes. Hallelujah. We we Bless your name, Lord. Yes. Over the equal You're God. worthy, Lord. You're worthy to be No praised. more will this continue in our life. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Thank you, God. Hallelujah. Jesus yes, and the divine restraining all that has been. Thank you, Father. Yes. God. We give you praise, Father. All praise for Jesus. Hallelujah. Yes, we bless your holy name. Thank you, Thank you. Only you can, Father. End with praise also. Have to end Thank you, Father. Hallelujah, Father. Bless your name, O God. Thank you, Jesus. Glory to Victory. You are worthy to be praised, We say thank you. Hallelujah, Jesus. Hallelujah, Lord. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Glory to your name, Lord. Yes, Lord. You are worthy, you are worthy, you are worthy of all of us. May we give our hearts You are worthy to be praised. Praise, Lord. Thank you for the verdict, Lord. God, in our life, Father, we thank you. Victory belongs to us, O God. Victory belongs to us. We receive it, God. Forward. 
Thank you, Lord. faith is impossible to please you, Lord. So receive it by faith now in the name of Jesus Christ. Have your way, Lord. Hallelujah to the Lamb of God this morning. Hallelujah to the great I am this morning. Worthy, worthy, worthy are you, Lord. Hallelujah, Jesus. Thank you, Father. Bless you. Thank you, Lord. Bless your name, Lord. Praise Glory to God. God. To you, Father. Hallelujah, Jesus. Thank you. We give you praise. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Amen. So we say our final greetings. May the grace of our Lord and Jesus, Jesus Christ, Christ, the love, the love, love of God, God, and the fellowship of the Holy Spirit be with us and provide with us now and forever. And surely the goodness and mercy shall follow us all the days of our life. All the days of our life. We will dwell in the house of the Lord forever and ever. Amen. And ever. Amen. Thank you so much, family. Thank you. Thank you. Amen.